Okay, joined by uh, Maddie Kenny. Maddie, a defeat here against Clare in the Allianz League this afternoon. Uh, your reaction to that result and the performance as well? Yeah, um, look at, I suppose in the in the um, in the first half we, we, we let Clare into their halfway through that first half and uh, we, we we got back on level terms at half time and uh, in the second half they wanted to push on a little bit but uh, they got a few early scores and give them give them that I suppose that platform and uh, you know they started playing with more confidence in and uh, you know uh, we weren't able to get back into the game against that breeze in the second half as much as we'd have liked. Um, the result brings an end to uh, Dublin's Allianz League campaign. Your reaction, uh, your assessment, I guess, of the league campaign overall? Yeah, look, at, I suppose, you know, we're, we're building nicely the last few weeks and uh, came with a good push there in, in Crow Park last Saturday night and I suppose we're disappointed when we didn't get the result and, uh, you know, I suppose, you know, losing to Wexford last Saturday night kind of virtually goes out of the, out of the league and, uh, you know, unfortunately, we picked up a number of number of injuries there last Saturday night as well. So, uh, you know, our, our our squad was a little bit depleted coming down today, but that also gives us an opportunity then to to give game time to other guys, and uh, hopefully that stands to us in the future. Yeah, one of the guys who got game time today was Liam Rush. Good to see him back on the pitch. One of the injuries last weekend was Chris Crummy. How is he looking? Yeah, Chris had shoulder 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 surgery there during during the week, like you know, so. You know, he'd be out for you know 12, 12 14 weeks to the looks of it. Like you know, so that's a bit of a blow to us at the moment. Like, but look at you know, uh, we'll, we'll 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 work with him and, and make sure that uh, we get a top of his rehab and, and get him back on the pitch as soon as possible. So I guess the planning starts pretty much now for the championship in a couple of months. Obviously, there's a club uh, club month in April, but over the next few weeks, I'm sure the planning starts for yourself for the championship in May. Yeah, we've we've, we've work to do. You know, no doubt, we've work to do. Uh, you know, as I say, you know, our, 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 a lot of niggly injuries in the last few weeks, and uh, you know, it's, it's a, it disrupted our flow and training. So we want to get you know everybody healthy and uh, push on and train over the next few weeks, or so release them back to their clubs. And uh, you know, you won't feel uh, May coming around in the championship again. And uh, you know, hopefully, you know, we'll be um, we'll have a strong squad uh, to choose from, a strong, strong squad to pick from. And that uh, you know, a lot of these injuries will clear up. But uh, I say it's also an opportunity for other guys uh, during the league. Uh, we've got a, a game time into a lot of uh, younger guys, and uh, you know the, the depth of our squad has improved. Like so, overall, look at you know it's uh, I suppose we're, we're, we're you know we're, we're in the position we're in is uh, you know our squad is much stronger now, much bigger, and we just need to get all the little, little small injuries cleared up and uh, and come as a good push for the championship.